Okay. So I passed. Minimize your risk of rear end collisions. Check expressway traffic to decide if you need to slow down or stop at the point immediately before the entrance of the merge lane. Keep in mind that the decision could be made for you by the driver ahead of you. If you're not entirely sure if you'll have to slow down or stop, touch your brakes lightly to alert drivers behind you that you may have to do so. The place to stop is just before the entrance of the merge lane. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Saada Tuesday. As you can see, I'm studying for my knowledge tests, my driving test tomorrow. And if you're watching this video, it means I have passed. Yeah, so I'm starting this vlog a day to the test. Tomorrow is the test and I'm studying. So I found, I found out that I could actually study online on YouTube actually. So the Manitoba Drivers um, Manual has the YouTube version, the online version that you can read, that you can watch. It also has, um, they also have practice questions for you to also learn. It's just like a simulation of the actual day. Yeah, and because of, I find it hard to read, to carry book and start reading. I found this really helpful and I hope it helps me to pass. So for those studying to drive, to get a driver's license here in Manitoba, you can explore this avenue. It's really helpful. Yeah, so I, my husband has done his own knowledge test and the practical and he has gotten his license. So after I do this and I pass, I'll also book for the practical, which is another thing, you know. <laughs> I have to sit down with an instructor and then you drive and you can't make some mistakes there's some critical mistakes that in fact we just tell you yeah let's go back to the office and i learned you can't fail more than maybe nine or something it's actually really stressful i just wish to pass it once pass this one once pass the practical once and then i'll just rest if you fail if anybody fails if my enemy fails <laughs> they'll have to book again not even the payment now because you have to pay for another booking you have to get a later date so this date i got it i booked it since i think um early late december and i got february 3rd as my date so you can imagine you can actually imagine how long it takes to get an appointment to get a knowledge test so you just want to pass it once and for all because if i fail this one now I will have to book again and I may get a date in April, not even March. I'm not even sure of getting March. So I've not been driving. Uh, I've been depending on my husband to drive me around because you can't drive without a license here. So the one I came with in from Nigeria, we could use it for three months and we've exceeded three months here. So it's I can't drive with it in Canada here. So I just have to get my license. It's high time I got my license. And it also helps in jobs. There are some jobs that you get that you require to get your have your license. If not, it's a really great criteria. Depending on the kind of job you're looking for. So I just want to get my license. Just pray for me. Let's say pray for me. If you're seeing this video, it means I've passed. So I'll be praying for myself. So it's actually for tomorrow. Yeah. All right, so I'll just allow you to watch some clips of it and see you tomorrow. I will be videoing when I'm going or probably help I remember or when I pass, I'll conclude this video. Bye, enjoy. You must proceed through a red light or stop sign with caution to clear the way. Get as close as possible to the right curve or edge of roadway and stop. Remain stopped at the edge of the road until the emergency vehicles have passed. On one-way streets, pull right or left to the nearest curb so you don't block the emergency vehicle. When passing a stopped vehicle with its warning lights activated, such as an emergency vehicle, tow truck, or a roadside assistance vehicle, slow down and proceed with caution, passing only if it's safe to do so. When two or more lanes of traffic in the same direction are available, move to the lane farthest from the emergency or designated vehicle 
provided it's safe to do so. This applies to drivers on either. So today is the D day for the exam. It's supposed to be 9.45 in the morning. I got here like 9.15, ready to do my test and pass. So I was really, really nervous really really nervous so this is me waiting my turn the other people here are here for other things like to renew their license to get drivers um extracts different things so i was so worried hey, with the look on my face you could know that i have Congrats. I have to drop a number again. I speak as I don't know. Yeah. Was this good? So how was it? Oh. Okay. Thank God I studied in this place. Most of what I read here. You could do that. Like half. Give out. Mm. <laughs> Those times. Oh. Hey. <laughs> so you have to set up a day for. Uh, that's the really main one. That's the main one. Oh. Mm. So there will be, yeah, you can look inside, there will be some numbers. Um, can you tell me what you see? So the next stage was um, testing my sights to see if I have any issues with my vision so that it will be stated in my record and it was really extensive so um most of what they asked me to do or to see if i could um see such things at least i was able to um identify all 100 percent so the results came out positive so for those people using glasses or don't they don't even know that they have eye issues or so it will also be like stated they want to know okay if the kind of glasses you are using is actually correct for the kind of eye issue you're having so this was the stage so after this my passport was taken and i was booked for another um three um, three weeks time to come do the practicals that's driving with uh, one of their staff to see how I can navigate the town and all that, obeying all the rules and regulations, all the road signs and all that. So that was it. So I passed and I've been scheduled for the practical. That's the main the main one. <laughs> Where someone will drive with me to to test me. That's on in three weeks time. So it's enough time for me to practice, you know. I'm happy I've passed this thing. I would have been so ashamed of myself if I didn't pass. <laughs> See you guys, thank you. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe.